hello guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video i wanted to do a cheetah inspired makeup look i just saw james charles do this on kylie jenner and then i fell in love with it so i wanted to recreate something like it since i haven't done a halloween video really hope you guys enjoy don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe i'm really excited i'm I'm not gonna do exactly what he did on her like the makeup wise i want to do the um scratch thing that she he did on her cheeks so i'm gonna start with that part because the latex does have to dry and by the way don't forget to subscribe if you guys like this video turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video and don't forget to like this video some liquid latex is just a you can find this literally at any like Halloween store about Faith Blood, but this is for later. So it's gonna be like the scratch of the cheetah that's gonna go the scratch that's gonna go like right here. Also have some tissue right here. So first I'm gonna start with the liquid latex. I'm just gonna put a bit in the cap. The way you do this is actually really really simple. Take um a little sponge, like those triangle sponges where I want it. So I want it pretty big, like it needs to be like the star of the show. So I'm gonna start from the middle. Go ahead, this is going to be the first layer and latex is actually really simple and easy to use and I'm just going to stick that right on. So after that's on, I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing again. So I have another layer, I'm going to go ahead and take another piece of tissue and just stick it on and like I said, remove any of this excess that we have go ahead and do another layer and then you're just gonna do that until you can make it as thick or as thin as you want but i'm just gonna make it a little bit thicker and then i'm gonna go ahead and start the makeup so let me do this and then i'll be right back do my eyes first so i'm thinking something brown with like i don't know something with a really dark brown so i'm gonna take the james charles x morphe palette and i'm gonna take the shade called beans this one this dark brown it's one of the bigger pans first actually i'm gonna set my eyes with this shade right here the first shade it's called canvas um it's just gonna be to set my my concealer and then i'm gonna take the shade no beans um the dark brown shade i'm gonna take that on a on this brush this is a morphe e17 brush pack this on the outer part of my eye so i'm gonna start buffing it kind of in my crease and just in my outer corner just feeling about halloween this year i honestly almost forgot that it was happening how how do you guys feel with like the whole pandemic and the fact that like we can't go like do things obviously like um last year i'm pretty sure i was at the club i don't think i went on halloween but i went the weekend like hollow weekend i think i went to the club and it was actually so much fun i was looking at my snapchat memories today and um that's what i was doing at this time last year but this year i feel like everyone's so out of it i haven't heard many people talk about halloween like people are just not into it this year just because it's technically like canceled take more of the brown but I'm gonna start putting it on my lid and in my inner crease. So I'm gonna start building it up and I'm gonna start bringing it to the inner part of my eye. Um, I'm gonna take an even darker brown. This shade is called Benny, I think. I'm gonna go ahead and take that more on my outer just to darken it a little bit more. Go ahead and alternate brushes. I'm gonna take, I'm gonna go in with the gold right now, right away, um, because I wanna start mixing in the gold with the browns. So I'm gonna take this shade, where is it? One is called So Good. I'm actually also gonna take Trophy Wife, but that's gonna be after, um, because I think it acts as a really nice shadow. Um, it's a highlighter, but you can really use it as anything i'm gonna take a pencil type art sorry this this is not a pencil the angled brush why am i not being able to talk and there's latex all over my nails I'm take the black shade which i think is called spooky which is convenient 
for the time so i'm gonna start by doing this on the outer portion of my eye so instead of doing like a really black eyeliner i really wanted to do something like a smoky eyeliner now i'm gonna take a pencil brush and i'm just gonna blend out the top of it i'm gonna go in with trophy wife um by frenty beauty my fave and I'm gonna put that also on my lid. This is a really intense gold, but I feel like it'll just add so much more to the eyes. Make it pop out so much more. So what I'm actually gonna do now, which I was gonna do this after, but I'm gonna do it right now. I'm gonna take a makeup wipe and I'm gonna go ahead and take off any fallout. I'm just gonna create a sharp edge now i'm gonna go ahead and do foundation so for foundation i'm gonna take my nars radiant um foundation in punjab so i'm gonna take like three pumps i'm gonna apply it with a brush um and i'm gonna take a little bit of my darker from beauty one just because i'm like still kind of tanned oh my god i didn't put primer i'm gonna take the elf putty primer i literally forgot I'm just gonna put this on my nose and my forehead. That's usually where I put it. Start stippling it into my skin. I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender after, but I wanted to use the brush first. I wanna get as much, can I speak, as much coverage as I possibly can. I need some lifting, so I wanna go ahead and cover up the sides a little bit more just to make them a lot more secure curious what are you guys doing for halloween this year like what could you possibly do like there's nothing to do so my latex is still drying a little bit so i'm gonna go ahead and fan it out guys don't kill me about the lighting i don't know what to do so go ahead and keep blending this Go in with some concealer. This is the Born This Way concealer. I literally haven't done a makeup tutorial in so long. I feel like I don't know how to do this anymore. Um, so I'm gonna use this concealer. I'm gonna take a foundation brush and I'm gonna start blending it out just so that I can really be precise for the part of my eye go ahead and i'm gonna set my face so i'm just gonna do this on my why am i holding this upside down i'm just gonna do this right under my eye i'm gonna set the rest of my face with a brush and i'm just gonna go ahead and lightly set here and so that just blends a little bit more and it's not wet. I'm gonna take the Chocolate Soleil Too Faced Bronzer. And then I am gonna go over it with a different shade. I'm still doing it over the part that has, you know, that cut. Um, it'll kind of disappear once we put the cuts over it, but um, I just wanted to blend in seamlessly Shade right here. This is an orange shade. You're probably like why are you using orange? Um, it kind of will just bring the look together. This is Code James, I think This shade up here, this is called I think rusted. No Halloween Nope rusted. I mix it with this one Have fear. Just blend it out. I think I'm gonna go in with an, another red because I don't like this. Um, I'm gonna use the shade under. This is a bright red and this is not gonna come off my face, but whatever. Something I like about Halloween is like you can kind of get away with, you know, really doing a lot and you're not weird because, you know, it's part of your look. So you're just like, yeah. I'm gonna do like a dark. Okay, I'm gonna do like a dark, dark brown. So I'm gonna do the shade no beans and it's this brush still has some black on it so i'm gonna make it really nice and intense i'm gonna go ahead and kind of line my lower lash line first and then i'm just gonna blend it out with this pencil brush i'm gonna continue with blush so i'm just gonna take my regular brush i'm just gonna put a little bit um you don't need to put too much i'm just gonna put a little 
dab. I'm gonna take trophy wife. I'm gonna take like a bit, take the most little amount, and just put some. I'm gonna spray my face with the, actually, yeah, I'm gonna spray my face with the Morphe setting spray. I'm gonna go ahead and do the inner part of my eye. I didn't even think about this before, but find the inner part of my eye. So, so I added a little bit of inner corner, um, clear eyebrow gel, and I'm just going to put that here. Oh, so this is gonna be really simple. You just need some black eyeliner, and I'm just gonna take a really dark brown. Um, so I'm gonna take a little pencil brush, and I'm just gonna put basically just little marks so i'm just gonna put like one right here take your black eyeliner okay and you just line okay guys we're like almost done we're getting to the end i went ahead and i took some scissors very carefully and i made some slits so i made four slits um as you can see in the latex and it it's pretty easy um just be really careful because you're using scissors obviously to do it um i think i'm gonna take some black first and just put it in the cracks i'm gonna take some red um eyeshadow like a really bright red this is gonna stain my skin but you know what it's life do that for all of the little slits and don't be scared to make this like a little bit more messy um just because you know obviously this is a cut from a animal and uh you know take, like a big fluffy blending brush and just start blending this out i do very much have to clean my brushes after this because obviously this is not good to put on your eyes after i put on the latex so make sure you clean your brushes so I'm gonna add the fake blood, this fake blood gel that I got from the Halloween store. Um, you can literally find these like anywhere. Take like the end of a brush, I'm gonna dip it, and I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna fill the cracks with the fake blood. Blur thing that I bought, um, I'm gonna put some, some on this. I'm just going to stipple some like excess all over i finish off with lips because clearly i like forgot to do lips i was like what but i changed into this bodysuit from img so i'm gonna take this um charlotte tilbury lip paint in pillow talk three intense i'm gonna go ahead and put this first um just as a lip liner and then i'm gonna go ahead and take the melted matte Too faced lipstick in naughty by nature i got this a while ago and it's actually a really really pretty brown color okay and that is pretty much all for this look i honestly really love how it turned out i love how this turned out i think it looks so good I'm so happy I did it. I'm so happy it's done because it's pretty late and I've been filming this for like two hours. But I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and turn on your post notifications so you don't miss a video. I hope you guys have a very happy Halloween even though we're inside. I hope you guys still do something fun. Um, you know, make it, do something creative, you know, just try to have fun. That is pretty much all for this video. See you guys in my next one.